Good morning. Thanks for joining us. For Local 3 News, I'm Brianne McLean. The toys donated through Toys for Tots in Marquette County are split between St. Vincent de Paul and the Salvation Army. Local 3's Rebecca Bartlemay caught up with the Salvation Army as they prepared for their toy distribution. One part of the Westwood Mall is filling up with toys, toys, and more toys. Over 300 families. Um, last year was 312 and over 750 kids got presents through this toy shop. This is Allison Lesage's first year running the toy shop program for the Salvation Army. She says she's excited to spread some Christmas cheer to families that may not have the opportunity to if it weren't for this event. It's, it's a great feeling. Um, the joy and appreciation from these families um, makes all the hard work worth it. Not only does this distribution provide Christmas presents, but they also give gift baskets with necessities to help these families get through the holidays. One Marquette County man shared with the Salvation Army what his experience has been like getting help for his family. It's made an impact on, on my children. I think probably the most because even when uh, we didn't have what we needed um, to get through it, I, we've been given gas cards, we've been uh, given food, we've been given uh, Christmas uh, presents when, when it was tough, um, you know, the tougher years, we were able to go down uh, and, and get the help that we needed. Lesage says they are distributing toys in Alger County on December 18th and then on December 20th, 21st and 22nd in Marquette County. Unfortunately, due to COVID, we're still doing a curbside pickup. So our awesome volunteers actually do the shopping for the kids. And then we bag them all up and um, the families come through like a drive through and pick up their toys and their food basket. Families in need have until December 10th to sign up for the toy program. So they can sign up at saangeltree.org and everything they need to do is on that website. If they have any problems, they can call our Marquette or Ishpeming office. Salvation Army is collecting items for the distribution leading right up to the event. Lesage says they are in great need of items for teenagers. If you can help out by donating your time and volunteering for the event, call the Marquette office at 906-226-2241. Thanks for joining me this morning. Now for a check on your forecast with meteorologist Tom Kippen. Thanks a lot, Bree. Here's what's ahead for today. We're going to have some snow continue today, and that snow is going to be coming with a colder wind, and in fact, it's going to be turning very cold, especially as we get later on into today and on into tonight. For weather anytime, if you're on the go today, you can track what's left of the snow and see current weather conditions on our WJMN Local 3 app, also online at upmatters.com. We're on Facebook as well at WJMN TV and also our 906 Weather Watchers page.